yeah happy new year everyone hope your holiday was awesome mine was spent with my parents it's been a really long time so i basically just want to you know share my plans for the year and walk you through my design software how i make most of the stuff i make so um i use a really old software that it's free because i like free things a lot from autodesk let's uh, open it right here um it's one two three design and it's a really old software it's discontinued so autodesk doesn't have support for it again basically this is the software it's just like a 3d space so you can now begin to draw so it has some uh, panels here and some buttons that you can use to to basically design whatever you want to design so you could use the polyline tool here to draw so let's say we want to draw a box so while you are moving the uh, cursor around you see that the measurements appear here so this is a 25 mm box so let's make it 50 mm 50 mm by 25 mm box so there you have it a box it's a really simple software no need for any serious tutorial lessons on it then to make it a 3d object you could just select the box and right click on the box and these options will show you extrude you select the height you want it to be let's say 50 enter and bam you have a box so that's basically it so you could make you could also make circles so let's make a circle so let's say 50 mm circle enter you could, sorry a cylinder you could also make it a cylinder you extrude 50 there you have it so it's free you could go online and okay i don't think it's online but i can provide a link for you guys if you want it if you want to use it to design you could also export your files from here maybe wow this is a really cool object i designed and you want to export it to a file to a 3d file you can use somewhere probably 3d print or laser cut or cnc mail so you come here you go to export 3d or you just select the object select the object like so and you click here you can now export it as a stl file so 3d printers understand stl file better mm -hmm. yeah so basically what i want to show you guys is the electric car i've been designing for a bit so i'll provide links to this software if you're interested and also help you guys to you know one or two tips and tricks on how to get software running electric car oh so yeah this is what i've been working on so this is my project for the first first and second quarter of the year it's an electric car um i have been working on it for a while getting the design and everything so basically this is an overview of the car it's going to carry two passengers it's going to be driven by an electric motor that i will place under here so basically the design is super simple i'm using um, round pipes and rectangular pipes to build it i'm using basic basic parts you could find you know off the shelf it's um, going to be a two-wheel drive car, so the drive system is going to be generated only at the back. The front is just for steering. But I thought to add cinematography capabilities because Mr. Uncle James Amuta, ace, um, ace drone pilot, suggested it. So I added a gimbal mount at the front right here. So this is a Blackmagic Cinema camera mounted on my design of a gimbal just in front of the car so now what, what this will help us do is you know we can now have really high speed chase scenes we can now have really cool cinematography shots without having to rent a really big car and also the possibilities are endless because this is a fun project for me but i'm beginning to see the opportunities in film in real estate and all that you know I'm basically seeing other opportunities with this car. I originally designed the car to just take me around my my area when I don't have to, when I don't want to drive. Just um, you know, have fun, drive around. But while I was designing it, I started seeing opportunities, and I feel like it's something that we should take seriously because it might change the cinematography 
space. So yeah, I'm using basic off the shelf materials. So this right here is a this is the regular Mara shock absorbers. It's not like exactly what how it looks, but you, you, get, you get the idea. Then I'm I'm either going to use Kekemara wheels or I will use this, you know those mini tiny buses they have that carry about six passengers from I think they have they have those buses from Ajax with Balinde and CMS. I'll use the wheels from those guys. They're quite they're quite you know they're big but I don't know I'll weigh the options. I don't know the prices here. But I think this guy, this Mara wheel goes for around 8,000 naira. Yeah. So I'll find out the price of the allowance. But basically, you could add, there's so many things you could add here. This is going to be battery operated. So there'll be an electric motor here that will drive this wheel. A very, very strong electric motor. And we'll have the batteries that would, you know, power the motors here. So I'm using four, four lead acid batteries that I will connect in series to get 48 volts and power the motor. And I'm adding more mounting options. So there'll be a camera mounting plate at the top. And there'll be one at the bottom. Also, I'm thinking that if I can make this chair for the camera operator, the swivel kind of chair, so he could face the front or face the back. Hmm. We'll work on that basically. I'm 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 gathering like a data sheet and also a spec sheet for the car. So that will help me like you know know how much it costs me to build it and if it's gonna be a sustainable business. But while I was thinking about all of this, I found these guys, where is my chrome? I found these guys. Let me show you these guys. They, so I, I discovered that they make go karts. Like, they, okay, this is normally called a go kart. I discovered that they make go karts here in Nigeria, somewhere in Ogun State. So let's go to Instagram. But they use a uh, gasoline engine. It's not the electric type, but it's super cool. Check them out. They are called Light Squad Carts. I don't know them. I'm, this is not a paid advertisement for them. I just like what they do and I feel it's cool. Please try and follow them. Um, I mean, they have awesome car, uh, go karts here. Check this out, man. And they sell. They're already selling from what I see. So, this is a really cool. Wow. So, it has a rigid frame, high torque output, 10 inch ground clearance. That's a lot. Um, 9 horsepower. Wow, the 13 horsepower engine, improved balance, stability, LED light, and night driving. This is awesome, man. You know, finding that they have something like this in Nigeria, it makes me really happy. So I think I should go check them out sometime. Wow, this is cool. Check this out. Check this out. This is looking really nice. I like the design. I like the type of wheels they use on it. So they have this one they are selling now. They did an ad on it. Let's watch it. So this is going for 650,000 Naira. Awesome, man, awesome. This is really cool. So yeah, they are also using the kind of uh, um, shock absorbers that I was thinking of using. So that, you know, validates my design. So this is going for 650,000 Naira from what I've seen here. I should give them a call. I should go check them out sometime. Nice. 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 This, is just, this is just amazing, man. Wow. So let's watch some real life driving videos. Okay. Awesome. So imagine using something like this for cinematography applications. The possibilities are endless. Wow, wow. This is cool. This is really cool. And this is all Nigerian. Awesome. So let's go back to the software. So if you want to design, you want to learn, you want to start making your products, you have something in your head, you want to just put it in 3D and convince people that it will work. This software is a free software from uh, Autodesk. I don't think it's online anymore. Let's check out the website first. So this is autodesk.com. 
but they have other free options on the website but i think i still have the installation file the setup file for this software so if you need it just um, indicate and i will send it to you via email so this is autodesk they're like the biggest uh, design software manufacturing company in the world so they have autocad revit autocad and these softwares are really expensive so this is one thousand six hundred and ten dollars they have a ton of softwares you could use for for design basically but they don't come cheap they are quite expensive so i normally would use the few things because I, I basically don't make money from this yet so it's more like a hobby for me so yeah so it's really basic for 3d uh, design product design uh, you want to prove your concept to someone you, you have this cool little idea that you feel that an investor might like you want to just you know prove prove to the investor that this product will work and you can't really physically you can't physically make the product yet you just want to have like a a design to show the investor that this product is viable. You could just come into your one to three design software, like I do, make the design and do like a demo. Basically, show someone that this will work. So, for instance, if I, for instance, I want to get someone to invest in this project, I don't have the money to make the car yet. I could just design it and do like a three D walkthrough of what the product will look like, and an investor will be more impressed and. You know, having to just draw it on paper and showing it to the investor. You don't need to be like, like a really, like an experienced or a trained or a certified or a PhD holder engineer to be able to use this software. It's, it's simple, it's basic, anybody can use it. All of the buttons and design elements are all here. You could scale stuff up, you could just, you know, go all out and feel like an engineer by just using this simple cheap free no by using this free software from autodesk so like i said it's not online anymore so you might not get tech support from it from autodesk on this software but if you need it i could email it to you um and you can start building your own designs so i hope to be done with this car by seven quarter of the year that's my really that's my big project for the year if you want to be part of this, you could just uh, send me an email, we could work together, we could uh, build it together, you have a better suggestion, you have something you feel, we could um, put into this project to make it better, you are probably working on something similar and you feel like, oh wow, this is nice, let's team up and make it great, I don't mind, it's a really cool project I've been thinking about for a really long time and I'm glad, I'll be happy to see this out there.